What is up everyone? This is Zordkin09 and this is going to be week number 6 of the progression of myself working out. So lately I've yet to actually gotten much sleep. It's because the fact that is, is that my parents are actually renovating the kitchen. Everything is being moved around. You may still hear some noises in the background. But I still got to make a weekly video regardless. Otherwise then the sun would set and then it's just not going to be ideal for lighting. So... I've not been getting much sleep, but that's okay because when I'm laid up at night, I'll be able to do some of the workouts, like using the ab wheel. This is not an advertisement, I'm not being paid for this, but this is actually pretty good if you want to get your abdominals, is that you're going to have to maintain your balance, and as well as that, you're going to have to push yourself with this. you got to balance, you got to make sure everything is just correct and then you get a good burn out of it when i used it the first time my abdominals were sore for about a good three days before i went back to actually doing more of it it was sore for another two days and then it was sore for one day i just gotta keep pushing myself more and more because with the competition i have with my co-workers they're going to be looking at the before and the after results so if i had a fat body now that if i have like a chisel six pack that's definitely going to be a better result so i'm going to be working on trying to get the six pack as well as I'm going to be working on my upper body strength because mainly we're not actually paying attention to the legs but I know we're not supposed to skip leg days but we are still going to be working that of course but mainly everyone's going to be focused on the upper body so that's what we're all going for for the front the back and the side pictures for the before and after so at least with the abdominals that's going to help me pretty much kind of win at the competition at least with a better look so this is what I'm going to be doing I'm going to be using the ab wheel every night so that I could get my six pack and and then, of course, I'm going to be working on my upper body strength every now and then. Just if I'm sore for one muscle, then I work on a different muscle. If I'm sore with that muscle, I go back to the other muscle because it's already been giving a day rest. So I just got to keep breaking and breaking and breaking the muscles. And they'll build and build and build. Just got to keep pushing myself and just maintain a good diet. Especially when I'm going to have a, you know, cheat day every once every two weeks. So that at least I won't have that sudden craving for food. And that guy is on his moped. He's been buzzing through down the street like nothing. He actually has his daughter with him, so I'm guessing that this is like their quality time. Appreciated, but it's like, yeah, today's the day that they decided to do that. So you may hear them coming back and forth from time to time. But regardless, so anyway, it says I gotta keep my diet where I'm just gonna stay away from fast food except for at least one day out of the two weeks. If anything else, then I'll just go to Subway. Not sponsored, by the way, but if I have a cra craving for food, then I'll just go to Subway and eat their sandwiches because they're so good anyways, right? Especially when you get their two like foot-long sandwiches for $6 each. You'll be set for a good two days. Just have two meals a day. Or it's supposed to be five meals. Oh, he came back buzzing again. Anyways. I think you're supposed to have like at least five meals a day just as long as there are smaller meals so that you keep your metabolism going and you keep burning the food off of your body by doing a little bit of exercise here and there. You got to remain active. But regardless, that's all I really got to say that I'm going to be working on my abdominals now and as well as I'm going to maintain my upper body with that as well. But that's all I got to say. If you'd like to join me with the workouts, feel free to do so. Just let me know if you're going to actually work out. And we're going to see how we are by week by week by week. And the deadline is going to be September 1st because that's going to be pretty much the end of summer and the start of fall. So let's see where we're going to be at within that three months of period of time. Especially when I started with week one a long time ago. So anyways, that's going to be the end of this video before I start to ramble on too much. So that is all. Have a great day, everyone. I am Sword Kings Around Zero. And if you got any tips and, you know, advice, that you would like to give me let me know whether it be nutrition and working out so that i can follow up with it and better myself the main goal is to actually have a better body and as well as more energy and better health overall and as always i will see you in the next video